Yo, what's up, YouTube? I just wanted to drop in and say happy belated Thanksgiving to everybody. Hope all y'all were able to enjoy your meals, some time with your family over there every day. I may look like I did, but I ain't did shit. My truck broke down yesterday. <laughs> had to get batteries replaced, and all I had was some nasty ass subway. Although their new sandwiches ain't too bad. No turkey and dressing and all of that for me. No chitlins, hog mom, nothing like that. But it's kind of my fault I had wanted to work on the holiday. But hell, if I knew now, <laughs> if I knew then what I knew now, I wouldn't have worked. But anyway, I just wanted to speak on something. What is all this drama in the trucking industry going on on YouTube? Truckers, coach, I don't know what it is, but nobody seems to like him anymore. He gives pretty good advice, but they want to get on him for job hopping and recruiting and all of that saying he's being bad for business for other other people hurting other drivers but how they're grown ass men shit they um they choose to follow somebody to a job and knowing that he may or may not stay that's on them y'all some grown ass motherfuckers y'all can't get mad um yeah he took some advice that they took his advice and went somewhere and it might not have worked out. Now he may have went to a couple of crap companies, but hell, they got reviews just like all the other ones. Hell, there ain't no good truck company out there. Anyway, that's gonna have a perfect review. But Super Ego, <laughs> that is a shitty motherfucker though, based on what I've seen, but yeah. But y'all going to eat on him. Y'all mad when he doesn't work all the time. But hell, what's wrong with a driver being able to set himself up, especially when he's been in game for two decades, to be able to not have to run hard all the time? Shit. And damn trucker wish he was able to be able to sit at the house um, a good bit of the month, especially when you don't have that much bills, your house paid for and everything, kids grown and shit. Well, y'all being some haters, that's all that is. Jealous and envious. Because you knew if you had a chance to sit your ass at home, you gonna sit your ass at home. So cut that shit out. All this unnecessary stuff, docs and all of that, that is ridiculous. Y'all need to cut that shit out. This ain't like how the drivers were back in the day. I may look young, but I've been doing this about 16 years now. And plus, my ex stepfather, he was a truck driver. I used to ride on the road with him in the 90s when I was a kid so I know a little thing or two about trucking but you need to get back to the brotherhood and all that hell you talk about these shit companies but hell how the drivers supposed to stand up to them when you can't even stand up to each other hell we can't even agree on the color of the sky at the time of the day there'll be drivers right now saying this video is done at 23.59 at night <laughs> anyway I, I just wanted to drop in with my little opinion you know, I'm probably gonna get trolled, especially on what's the app, the Zello app. But I'm ready for it. I can troll. And yeah, I'm trolling now. Although I am a Trump supporter, but I'm still trolling now because I know there are a lot of goofy liberals that follow me. So, my guy.